Hey everyone. So today I'm going to show you a method on how to open sketchy or suspicious links. And uh, the best way to do it is through an online virtual machine like uh, browser link. So uh, I mainly got this idea from another YouTube video uh, over here the, by Nev's Tech Bits. And uh, like somehow when I'm searching for this, it doesn't really show up in the top option. So I thought I'd, you know, maybe spread the word and uh, yeah, give more information on this. A lot of times when I search on how to open suspicious links, uh, they send us to a URL checker, uh, which tells us if the link is safe or not. But a lot of us are curious and we want to know, you know, what exactly is behind the link. So uh, this is the best way to check it. And I should like show you a short demonstration on how to do this. So here's a link that I got from Reddit. Basically, uh, basically someone was trying to scam them with this. However, this link does not work anymore. And I don't have any recent uh, links uh, with you know similar content. So anyways, I'm gonna demonstrate by showing this. Uh, you can choose which version of Windows you want over here, but I believe those all are in the paid version of this. You can also uh, choose which browser you want and which version. So I'm going to click test now. And yeah, luckily we're first in queue. Sometimes you might have to wait in a queue so as to you know, get your link, uh, link up and running. So yeah, most of the times we are in the first itself. So yeah, as you can see, this is uh, the virtual machine that's working right now. And in this, you can open any link you want, basically. Yeah, so right now we have this, uh, you know, warning that this website might not actually be safe. And it's asking us to like close this web page, but we're, we're going to continue instead. And yeah, this is this is what shows up account suspended. So I'm just going to end the session here. Okay, so whenever you open these links, just be sure not to give in any of your uh, details in it, whether it comes to your email or especially your banking details like CVV and all those. Uh, just avoid giving them, and you'd be able to stay safe. Uh, some of the some of these links would be able to you know attack your uh, computer without you even knowing it, they might be able to steal your information. And by using an online virtual machine, you'd be able to prevent that from happening. Also, uh, checking the link through an iPhone works because iPhone has really good security. However, uh, you know, some, some viruses are there like Pegasus, which, you know, can still compromise your iPhone. So even if these are rare, it's, it's best to try to open these through a virtual machine. Now, uh, this is basically the free version. Uh, so there's a restriction on the number of links that you can try out on this. Uh, you can see the pricing options over here. But yeah, uh, you can do a maximum of three, I think, uh, three links per day. Uh, if you want more, then you might have to use a VPN and change your IP address. Also, the Windows version, uh, if you want to use Windows 10, let's say, uh, you'll have to upgrade to a paid plan. So yeah, that's that's all I have about uh, sketchy links and uh, stay safe.